Hey guys, it's Professor Lemons back with another video. Today we're going to be playing Mario Galaxy again. And we're going to be doing the Sweet Sweet Galaxy. And I know where you're thinking, wait a minute. There was no Sweet Sweet Galaxy unlocked in the last video. Yeah, I'm aware of that. So, uh, what I'm doing is I'm playing a level that you get from a Hungry Luma. You gotta feed him Star Bits and he'll give you this level at the Terrets. Yeah, I I know I said I wasn't gonna do these, but I think I'm at least gonna do these this one. And maybe I'll do others. Depends. I'll probably do the easier ones. Which means I'm not doing the one for the fountain. Because I really hate motion controls, and that's when they're kind of most needed. Nice, a life. Yeah. So, we don't have common, if I haven't already said that already. I'm pretty sure I haven't said that already. But I don't know if I have it. Because I really don't remember anything. And we're already done with the level. Yes, we are going to be doing the boss level. I just thought it might be better to start off with this. At least. Well. Wait a minute, am I supposed- is there dialogue? Is there dialogue? Because it should have just spawned me farther back. Uh, no. Oh, okay, cool, there isn't. Uh, let's go do the boss level, shall we? You remember, we left off, last level we did the ghostly galaxy. Oh yeah, I got secret stars. You ready? Even though it's Bowser Jr., we're still doing, it still has Bowser's face. But yeah, we're doing this. Okay. I thought it would be better if I just start- if I just was at the beginning of the level I was gonna start with. So that's why I was in the- that's why I was in the Sweet Sweet Galaxy doing the Rocky Road level. Thank goodness I didn't die there. I think we're almost at the end already. Of course we were almost at the end. Why else? Where else would it be? Yeah, I have issues with speaking. At least we spawn right here. Okay, you guys ready? Because I am. Oh, I did it! Oh, wow, we are at the boss place. Okay, you ready? We get to destroy Junior Bowser for the second time. We still get to destroy him for a third time. Oh, dang it. I'm not doing anything. That's very bad. I should not start with that. Nice. The bullets lost where they were aiming. 
Oh, come on. Have you not abused me enough, game? Oh. I need help. I don't remember... I don't ever remember this being that hard. I remember this being easy and, like, you could do it in one try. Well, I guess I am gonna... I might be able to pull it off in one try. Okay, that should blow up my shell. Come on, throw it! There we go! Five minutes into the video, because Junior Bowser is the one. too much of a spread to it. I think it's overpowered. Oh, cool, I did it. Six minutes into the video. That's two levels already. That's pretty good. I sound like Donkey Kong, where I can do them in two, two minutes. I was actually good at these video games once. Can you believe that? Yeah, me neither. This would have been better with Colin. Itch. I literally skip dialogue because I'm very sick and tired of this. Dialogue's stupid. Oh, I'm sorry, I shook the camera a bit. I wanted it to be the new one in the kitchen. Okay. I guess we won't get buoy base until a long time. That's me making noise. And that was also me kicking something by accident. Oh. <laughs> You'll be able to fly for to, to your special one in the center of the universe. I don't think that's how it works, though. I was planning on doing Gusty Garden's Galaxy in a video. So maybe we could go through chapters? Yeah, let's go through chapters. I'm sorry, I have to find something to do. I don't even read it to you. Chapter 1, The Celestial Duo Our story begins with a very, very long time ago with a young girl. One day, this girl spotted a rusted spaceship holding a small child. I don't think the spaceship was supposed to look like a mushroom. That was my dialogue. What's your name? Are you lost? The girl asked the star child. I'm Luma. And I'm waiting for Mama. She's coming for me on a comet, said the star child, who had been waiting for the day and night. Don't worry. I'll wait with you, little girl, promised Luma. Oh, okay. I'm like, wait a minute. Did you just call the Luma a girl? I don't think it has a gender. But I, I don't know that. I don't know. At nightfall, the little girl borrowed her father's telescope and peered into the night sky. She looked and looked, but she saw nothing. Hours turned into days, and then years, but still, the sky revealed nothing. Oh, this sounds pretty depressing. Finally, the little girl sighed and said to Luma, If we stay here looking much longer, I'll be an old lady soon. But then, 
she had an idea. I'm closer up to the microphone so you can hear me better. Now I'm closer. The girl in the Luma fixed the rusty spaceship, and then the two set sail into the starry sky. And this is how the search for the Celestial Mother began. Oh gosh, can I handle chapter two? Oh wow, this is too much pressure. This is a very hard level to beat. Days passed with no sight of Comet or even a single planet. Instead, asteroids extended for as far as the eye could see. If I had known it was going to take this long, I would have packed more jam, said the little girl above, above the rumble of her belly. Oh, I see a star bunny right there. Before they left, she had packed all the essentials. Telescope, butterfly net, stuffed bunny, bread, milk, jam, and apricot-flavored tea. Apricot-flavored tea? What? I forgot to bring water. At this, Luma burst into the gales of laughter, and the girl began to pout. As long as I have star bits, I'll be fine, said Luma. Want some? The little girl couldn't stay mad at after hearing this. Oh. Luma continued to laugh, and the girl couldn't help but join in. All right, maybe just a nibble. Oh, okay. Leaning far and out the ship, the pair began to collect star bits with the girl's net. They almost fell out a few times, but they kept in co collect co kept on collecting. Star bits tasted like honey. Okay. Oh gosh. <laughs> I'm scared here, guys. I don't want to do this. The beam of light pierced through the ship's window. Oh, you know what? I, I want to die now. <laughs> you know what? You can pause the video if you really want to read it. I'm really sad now. Okay, did you guys enjoy that? Uh, did you guys enjoy that? Because I did not. Pause the video if you really want to read it. Oh, nice. Oh, we can read the chapters again. Hey, where's the books with quality? The library is in here. Oh, yeah, like I haven't figured that out already. Thank you, sir. Now, I guess we're gonna go talk to this secretive guy right here. I've got a secret, but I'm not telling. Screw you! Jerk! Fight me! <laughs> How did that not kill him? Okay, well I guess this is our shortest video. I'll just end it right here, where you can see everything. So, thank you all for watching, and goodbye.